In my early days, when I was my strongest, and I really was my strongest, What's today's workout? Two times 15, three times 10, LT2. Last workout in the block. It's hard. Is it Norwegian hard? Um, we're getting there. First race of the second half of the season. Uh, obviously, it's a, a big race. It's the PTO Canadian Open. It's the first real showcase event for the PTO. Um, obviously, we had the Collins Cup last year, um, but this is you know our you know the board of athletes, the group of athletes. That's this is our first major, and uh, it's definitely exciting to be a part of. Uh, you know, for me personally, the the. Journey has been a little bit uh, interesting the last month. Um, I took a little bit of a break after my last race in uh, mid-June and uh, had a little brush in with COVID and another little brush in with the side of a car. Um, but we came through those uh, a lot better than we could have. And so, yeah, I mean, it's, it put me on the back foot a little bit in terms of timing, but uh, I'm excited to go and toe the line with uh, the best in the world. I think for me the key is to have a really good swim, to be ideally within 30 seconds of the leaders on the swim, uh, certainly not more than a minute back, and then ride really aggressively on that first lap of the bike just to get myself into a position where I can see the front of the race, you have that motivation of those other guys around, the 20 meter, you know, 20 meters behind these athletes isn't going to be a huge draft, but you have that, you just have that mental kind of knowledge that you're right there and just don't let it go um, and I believe I can do that I've done that at 70.3 worlds done that at Oceanside uh, done that several times so that's going to be the key for me and then trying not to to over to overdo the bike if possible I mean it, it could be extremely difficult just to stay in contention near the front so I'll do what I have to do but um, ideally getting off the bike you know right close to the lead if not right with the leaders and that's what I'll need to, to position myself to, to have a chance for a podium. Uh, you can't have, you know, guys having one or two minute leads with the caliber of runners you have here. So uh, that's going to be the key for me. This is my third salad today. Salad a staple for you? No. This is probably my third salad this month. It was a good one though.
Just seeing what uh, Paul Finley watches on race week. Recaps of the World Track and Field Championships. So it's like un you cannot make them wider or you just need time to work on it. Yeah. Okay. So what is the purpose of this ride for you besides this, the pickups? <laughs> the purpose is to test out my new hydration setup on my UCI legal TT bike to see if I want to ride this bike in five days or if I'm just going to ride the tri shift Eric made me a custom front. Thoughts, feelings? Yeah, I like it. It's good. It feels good. Well, I think we're only bringing one bike in the van, yeah? No, I think I'll take both bikes as a backup. Do we have room? We have room. What bikes are you bringing? Do we have a mental room? I'm just bringing one, my TT bike. Oh, nothing else? No, I would bring, yeah. I don't know, I just need to think about it. Like, I like that bike. I'm just I want to try it with the pads a little bit wider. Yeah, okay. Just because, like, I feel like it's more crunched. Yeah, yeah. But For sure. Now I know exactly what you're feeling. But it's, I do like it way better for climbing, so. And just for. I like it. Canada is beautiful. Race week. How you feeling? Okay. <laughs> Hope to feel better on Sunday, but uh, getting there, it's good to be down at sea level and feel a little bit of extra oxygen after having been in altitude. But I also would have preferred to have another month of high intensity training but uh, will be interesting what are you 100k on the line 100k distance 100k price purse so uh, you do want to have a good day for what, sure what are your thoughts on the new uh, brit that's just entered the race uh, alistair is he in yeah uh, let's hope he turns up on race day you know it's been uh, Two races so far where it's been on the list too, so uh, let's see on Sunday.